Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Hello everyone, Mr. Blue here. I hope I got all the settings and stuff set right this time. I got my live documentary set at 15 dB. Game audio is set at 29. Uh, we are starting a new map today. And uh, just for you know, I'm going career. And these are my previous games my two play around games here and this is the one that we do at uh, Gold Crest Valley we're gonna do save game number four folks uh, I'm debating should I do horror or normal I guess we're gonna go ahead and start on hard y'all probably like no 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 I can't help it, folks. All right, we're going to do Sanofka. Hope I'm saying that right. And y'all probably like, oh my God, why that map? Why, folks? Been getting a lot of people wanting it. All right, here's all my DLCs I have installed in case we do some multiplayer and y'all want to join. As far as I know, I have everything possible to get. Uh, they came out with the homework pack today. I love that. But, uh, folks, as far as I know, the DLCs and all this stuff here doesn't matter if you have it on or not. Because me and my son tried a little experiment. And I turned all of his off. He signed on. You know, we, we saved the game and everything so they would stick. Done it a couple of times, went back. And, you know, we shut the game completely off, Xbox off, and came back on, tried again. His DLCs and everything that I just showed y'all was still off. And he joined the multiplayer, and it still let him through. So, just in case y'all was warning about that. All right, we can start now. All right. If you're not familiar with the game, Basics is recommended that you first tutorials get started. Uh, okay, I don't want to do a tutorial, but let's, uh, hopefully we can skip that. Let me turn my light off here. All right, folks, I love that this right here. One thing I wish they would change, and I, I haven't looked at the stuff, but they should fix it where we could upgrade the buildings and stuff, like busted out windows or whatever it is up there, be able to put new ones in, clean this stuff up, maybe paint our tanks and stuff, and as we play, let it come back to this right here. Let it eventually turn back to rust. I think it would be so neat. That's our cow area over there. Uh, let's see here. Top in this tractor here. Okay. Look like they stepped up the graphics just a little bit. I like that. That's a sunroof. But uh, let's go check out. Uh, I guess I better hook up to the wagon. There we go. 43.5 hours, folks. Oh, my goodness. That's a lot of hours on the stretcher. All right. Uh, I can't go nowhere. Oh, I got to start my engine. All right. Let's do this, folks. We're going to have to do some changes. Oh, wow. Look at that map. Y'all remember that map? Let's see here. Look like the chicken coop, maybe. And look here, folks, on the 18. Is that the? That should be the pigs, because the cows are over here. 
and that's the sheet down here still got the same companies look like but we gotta go check that out here in a minute everything else looks the same except for the pig area uh, we'll go buy the animal shrimp y'all see that on there I do not see it folks might be at the garden center who knows but anyway uh, let's see here what fields do we own this 19 and 14 let's see if I can zoom in here ah yeah, it looks like we just own 19 and 14 19 is well it's ready I prefer to be that color right there I think it gives us a little bit more more uh, yields in our field all right, uh, oh Oh, yeah. All our fields going to need cultivating. Go figure. Uh, we have nothing in storage at all. And wow. We're going to have to update some tractors here pretty soon, folks. A uh, $100,000 loan. Wow. No animals. Uh, everything is zero on that. Here we go, folks. We need a uh, color blind of money. It needs to be dollars. Measurements need to be miles. We're going to keep that on, too. Radio's got to be off because of copyright material. Uh, reset vehicle camera. Let's see. Oh, that needs to be off. I don't know what that does. Anybody knows, leave me a comment down at the bottom, okay? Because I, I really don't know. Switch to trains. Can we drive the trains on here? We're going to have to check that out, folks. Uh, let me drop this volume stuff down just a little. Uh, go to the next one. Ooh, and slow that time scale down. Let's uh, do this real quick, shall we? Let me turn my light on so I can see my keypad deal I got here. And uh, y'all hang loose just a minute. I don't know if that makes any difference or not, but I always like to put it in there. Whoa! There we go. Oh man. I messed up again. Let's see here. Delete. Oh, that's that button. There we go. Mr. Blue Farms. Enter. All right. My light back off so I can see traffic on dirt normal. Yeah, uh, let's go normal automatic engine start on for now. Uh, stop and go braking fuel default pepper refuel or refuel. I mean, refill not fuel. Let's go ahead and leave all them off for right now. Uh, I don't know, folks. Oh, you can tell them where they... You can tell them where to do it. Cool. I didn't know that. Rest of these are just regular things. Uh, plant growth, we want that fast. Plant withering. Folks, I gotta use mine off because sometimes I forget. That'll be a lot of money. Uh, plowing required is on. Fertilizers of three states. Uh, let's go ahead and save that. 
and yeah folks let's let's check a map out here it look like we got uh, that what is it Zetra that must be our planters and cultivator oh I wish uh, they wouldn't start I wonder if we can move those pallets Uh oh folks, check us out. We've been on 15. It used to be uh, those in-game conveyor belts. I guess we got to buy our own now. Wow. See, like the 10 coming off of these. We should be able to do it like an upgrade to our buildings. I think that'd be so neat. There's our combine. Let's see here. Combine and this, so we only got two tractors. They took the old, the little bitty old tractor out. Ain't that something? Well, folks, I hate to say it, but we gonna uh, look like we gonna have to do a couple rounds or a couple of fields with these things. I'll go ahead and get the planter going. Uh, wheat, barley, canola, soybeans. Let's start off with soybeans, folks. And see how that goes. Okay. Nah. Let me check something real quick here before we get started. I'm going to hop out, hop back in. Switch, switch back. Okay, yeah, our camera's doing like we want. Alright, he's planting soybeans. Let's get on our, in our combine here. And let's see here. Disable straw. Okay, we don't want no straw right now because I don't think we got any way of picking it up. What's that we... We uh gonna go ahead and sell this wheat. There we go. See what the inside view looks like. Okay. We're the same as the other one. Folks, I know y'all probably can hear that train coming through. I am so sorry about that. I really got to get me a recording studio or something somehow. Let's see. I need to do this. Folks, I've been seeing YouTube commercial uh, not not commercials, but YouTube videos. A uh, GPS mod that might be coming out. I just hope and pray it don't have no scripts in it. That way the consoles can get it. Oh, folks, this brings back so many memories of Farming Simulator 15, and I ain't going straight, am I? Oh, well. Come out to the end, and I just turn my camera where I mess up. Ah, perfect, got it. Yeah, my uh, old map on 2015 Farming Simulator. All these trees was down time I got done. I think I had one tree in that whole map. And that was over for the cows. I don't know if we can do this in that way or not. I see it's still got these ones here in it. But at least we should be able to pick up the limbs and stuff off of them now. With the hand tool. Yeah, folks, that's how I, over here in the uh, United States, I don't know who I was watching from where, but uh, I live in the middle of the United States almost, uh, states of Arkansas, and the county's Mississippi. But uh, 
Don't get that mixed up with the state of Mississippi, y'all. But anyway, over here, most of our farmers, when they come out to the end, they don't stop. They just raise up like that right there. They swing out a little bit like that, then back like, but now out this far. Oh. And they come back in, they don't stop, they slow down a little bit, oh. And they just do it like that. On this game, they come out to the end and stop, raise up their header, and turn around. Which I guess that would be a little bit more safer or something, I guess, but it looks like it's wasting a little bit of time. Y'all, I sure did waste a through on that, didn't I? If I just got over it a little bit more, it would have been so much better. And I also had a couple people ask me why don't I do first person. I'm not claustrophobic, but it just don't look like there's very much of a view here. Which I know would be more realistic, but folks, I have drove a real combine before. And uh you just be able to tell where your marker's at a little bit better in real life. I bet you I missed some there. Be yeah, alright, you turn while holding the RB button. You gotta match the RB button and let your header up and down. Along with B. But it's okay, I guess. Well, at least I didn't miss none. But anyway, how y'all doing today? I forgot to ask y'all that. I'm doing pretty good myself. I'm sitting here enjoying this game, Farming Simulator. There's one thing. Yeah. Can I do this and still go? Nope, it stops me. We're going to have a look at this map, folks. Both of these fields need to be plowed. Wow. What are we going to do? I don't think we got a plow. And I know those tractors over there ain't going to be able to do one. So what are we going to do? I ain't no telling what this crop yield is going to yield. Alright. I'm going to come out to the end here. Like I just did. And now I'm going to hire a worker. And just get me started. That's all I'm going to do. Okay, I'm going to let him go through this first through here, and then I'm going to take back over. While he's doing this, oh, wow. He's going across pretty good, eh? Uh, ah, wrong button. Open cover. There we go. Let's see. I don't know which way he's going to go, but we need to empty him, I think. Oh, he's 50%. And he's going the right way. Okay. Let's just go ahead and empty him out. We're probably going to have to do a couple of missions here, folks, so we can get some money. We're going to need a plow. And we're going to need a fertilizer buggy. Ah. I'm trying to get my crew set. Huh. I done a very good job of it, Emma. Okay. There we go. Right at the end. 
That figures. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, pipe in. There we go. Almost messed up. Now I am back to driving them. See how you weak wings. Just doing this so we can save some money. We're already down to 14.3. Hmm. I bet that field right there, one of those two fields right there would give us a lot of money. Uh oh, came in kind of crooked. And I missed a spot. Oh, man. Why do I miss it? I sure don't miss this map. I can tell you that right now. But I'm going to do a let's play on it. How many times a week? I have no idea. And how long my video is going to be? I have no idea. So y'all just going to have to hang with me. Uh, this is probably going to be based on how I feel and how busy I am because here all this week it's going to be kind of if I remember right it's going to be in like the upper 70s and that's my kind of weather you outside to do things it's not too hot not too cold but yeah my temperature is like between 60 and mid 70s And I need to work on my solar project that I've been working on. And I'll have a link where you can go and check out all my videos. I'm not going to post uh, like a bunch of different things on here. I'm just going to well, be down in the description of underneath this video when y'all watching on YouTube you uh, just be able to click on the link if I put it in right and it's going to take you to my YouTube channel but uh, I have done I think I'm up to episode 14 on Go Crest Valley but y'all y'all can't see all them yet that I got them uh, pre-recorded I guess you can say it helps me out with editing and stuff like that I think today well y'all probably won't get this till tomorrow actually I don't know when y'all get it all depends on how my audio goes because I've been having trouble out of my audio I am losing my laptop along with an external mic and it seems to be working pretty good on the couple of tests I made but uh yeah I don't know what's wrong with the game catcher or Xbox headsets or whatever the deal is I'm gonna have to ah I missed another one no But anyway, uh, last time I checked, you know, me and my son been doing a couple of multiplayers before we were recorded. His and my daughter's kind of like low volume, and every now and then mine gets low. But I never thought nothing about it. And I got looking today on Elgato's website. You have to have a cable to get your sound. Ah, no, 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 no. I want not to hit that. Just going to go down beside it, scrape it all up. Yeah, there we go. But anyway, come find out 
that you gotta have a gate a cable to catch the sound from your headsets and stuff I thought if it was a wireless headset it would go through but come find out now I might be wrong with this y'all y'all quote me if I am anybody out there know anything about Elgato gaming let me know down in the description okay I mean down in the comments but uh what I'm doing or was doing it was putting on team chat and the Elgato sound thing and then just using my wireless headphone for me and on my son he's using a wired uh, Xbox One headset and and we are on Xbox One y'all so maybe here before long I can get me a PC or something but for right now just doing the Xbox One I think that's going to take too much time turning around like that. Yeah. But yeah, so apparently it's showing this Y cable that plugs into the uh, headset and then the other plugs into the controller, I believe. And the other end plugs into the Elgato. So I, I don't know. I guess I'm going to have to order that and try it or see what the heck I'm doing wrong. But uh, yeah. So I hope what I'm doing right now is going to work. But the sound I've been getting has been through the laptop all along on my internal mic and I thought it was coming through the headsets but right now I am doing the uh, yeah, I don't know how to pronounce it it's S-O-O-N-U-H-A microphone got about uh, maybe a two and a half three foot cord to it plugged into my laptop here and uh, it seemed to be doing pretty good. Uh, Y'all let me know down in the comments if it's too loud or not loud enough or game volume's too loud. Like I said earlier, uh, my mic is 15 dB and it goes up to 20. So 20 is the max. So I actually turn it down a little bit. And the game audio is set to 29. Let's see here. I don't know if that wagon's going to hold all this or not. But what I'm going to do. Uh, I don't know. One part of me is saying to take this and put it in a silo. And just do missions. And the other part of me is telling me that I need to sell it and then turn around sell the planter we got and the cultivator we got and see if we can find a better planter that will do the no-till plant. Let's see, I'm fixing to put him on hired helper long enough so we can look at the planters. I don't think he'll stop if he's hired. Okay, he's hired. Let's go check out the planters. Let's see, that's what we got now. Okay, we have to be, oh man, I don't think we got a tractor to pull that in. But no previous cultivating or plowing is necessary. That's uh, potatoes. And that in there is corn, but you have to plow with it. And that's on bigger. I know we don't have one that does that. And let's see. $52,000. 
Okay, it doesn't fertilize, so 180 horsepower. Uh, oh, okay, I thought he stopped. Let's go check out our garage. 180 horsepower. That's 117 and 127. Folks, we ain't gonna have a uh, tractor big enough. Let's see. Well, I get the that right there. 180 horsepower. Okay. Let's go over here to the tractors and see. We have to go up that far. That might be able to pull it. But that's 195 horsepower. No, I know it's got to be. That dude right there pulled it last time. Let's see here. I wasn't looking at the picture I go, guys. I'm going to go forward. Well, it's New Holland. A lot of people call them forwards. Oh, we can get the Massey. Go a front attachment for it. Spice up the engine. It gives us 130. Could go with the fence. We got enough money. I always like to uh, boost up their engines as much as possible. Narrow tar standard, standard and narrow. Okay. Hmm. I don't know, folks. We go, we're gonna have to do something. Ah, he's full. Where did he go? Oh, it's back this way. Oh, stop, mister. Stop, 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 stop. See if I can cut in front of him, make him stop. Put that pipe out. Yeah, let's hope it's a catch. Yay, we did it, we did it. We don't usually pull them from a combine to get them stopped, put his pipe out, but this is more realistic than driving through the crops. Okay. 2,500. Eh, it's not going to hold it all, folks. Okay, our planter's done. I don't know which one of these tractors is the biggest, but uh, we're going to drop our planter right here. I wonder if it matters which one of these. Uh, I guess you can drop your potatoes anywhere now. I want to get into sugar beets for the cows instead of potatoes. That way we can use the the homer and everything. I can't wait to get the money to get that massive beast. All right, we're going to turn around here. Ah, straighten up. Go ahead and hire him for right now. And uh, oh yeah, we're full, folks. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to your price board here. What we got anyway? Wheat? Yeah, we got wheat. Wheat. Mm, the highest price is four sixty one at Village Grain Elevator. Okay. 
Village Grain Elevator. Where is Village Grain Elevator? No, I can't be that close. Village Grain Elevator, right there. Hmm. Okay. Village Grand Elevator. That's where we need to go. Uh, we're just going to let him go ahead and do his little business there. And we're going to run up here and... Oh, look. We got a green... Uh, signing... Uh, not sign. Uh, a green bean shining at us. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, man. Sorry, folks. I was not paying attention. I was trying to remember how to get over. I don't want to see here. Close the cover. Why? Well, ah. Hey, we. Y'all see that? We do have uh, like a dirt mod. I didn't think it was possible for consoles because one of the YouTubers was showing where you come out of the field and the tires kind of muddy and then it slung it off which we might not have the graphics like the PC does but All right, our combine got finished uh, this thing got beacon lights yay we got beacon lights let's see here turn in here And there we go. I wonder if that disappears as we go through. Uh, do I need to touch it? Or? Ah. Okay, that did not disappear. Okay, oh, stop. Unload. Yay! Okay, how we untag that? Uh, oh, untag. Okay. Okay. I figured something out. Three hundred and sixty or uh, $3,695 for harvest income. Wow. Uh, well, let's see. Folks, let's take a, a look at our garage. Whoa, 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 wrong one. Uh, we're going to go to garage. We got two tractors, combine, and okay, that's all we got. No plow whatsoever. Let's take a look at a cheap plow. Of course, I'm already planted, so that ain't going to work out. Got one for twelve. Got him. All right, folks. We we just gonna have to deal with the loss this time around. I hate to do that. I really hate to do that because there ain't no telling how much of a loss. Dang trailer. But yeah. uh I just don't know, folks. We really need to plow, but we already got that one field planted. We're plowing the field we got now. Oh, uh, we can't see our beacon lights from in here. Why? Wow, I can't stay on the road. Hmm. I just don't know what to do, folks. Mr. Blue is puzzled. We need to do the fertilizers. Fertilization. For sure. So I should have bought a... Uh, wow. Pretty good cleaning this field out. 
me see here. Switch over to combine. Pipe out. It's LB and down on the D-pad. We're not going to have very much here, but we want to go ahead and go sell it. And then see, see, well, we're waiting on him. 6,300. We got enough to get a fertilized buggy. Okay. Wish we had enough to get that, but our tractor is too small for that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and select that and buy. Yes. Okay. We're down to 10,000, folks. Okay. Mr. Combine's done. Let's go ahead and take move him out of the way. Let's go ahead and put him under the barn. That's one thing I like about... Oh! Sure can't see like this. Where's that tree at? I don't want to run in the tree. don't want to run in the video live over there either. Hey, at least we got a monitor in this one. Look at there. See, zoom out so I don't hit nothing. Alright. Perfect. Okay. And let's see here. Put our cover on. And we're going to go back up there. Sell what we got. Ooh, I almost hit that, folks. That was pretty close. But we're going to sell what we got here and go over to the shop, market shop, and get our fertilized buggy. And yeah, we might draw a little bit of money out of the bank, folks. We need some food for the cows before we even get started on cows what y'all think I'm going to take a little shortcut right here see if this tractor handled this whoa 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 right off in that water over there and I'll really be up the creek wanna I was, thought I was coming around the back side there but Okay, right B and Y to dump. I don't know if you can still cross there or not. On a farming simulator 15, you can cross. You got a shallow spot there that you can cross. Uh, folks, we need some more money. So, you know what? Y'all got time to do a mission? I think we got time to do a mission. We we got about 17, 18 minutes left before the hour is over. Ooh, we get to drive the N series. Uh, how you pronounce it, Vata? Okay. And one thing, folks, you can uh like how it went in here is just uh on the left stick, you just push down. But you see the price up there, sixteen seventy nine out and in it drops so it goes to 1291 you keep on going in and it looks like this is the best price 1679 you do that a couple times you swap back and forth and get the best price all right case ih puma oh i wonder if it's john from puma plow I would like to play with him on their map. I really would. But that probably won't ever happen. That's another thing, folks. I see some of these newer YouTubers where they're actually doing multiplayer games now. But, uh, like I said on my other episode of Go Crest Valley, I'll do it on this one here, too if you want to my game 
tag or, or game tag, whatever it's called, will you look me up? Is Luxor One on Xbox One? I'll be glad to take. I'm going to call them applications. I need some help on my farm. Uh, I want to be trustworthy now. I don't want. I ain't going to put up with uh, a lot of people cussing on the game. I won't put up with people planting grass in my fields. And I won't put up with people just, you know, doing oddball stuff that they ain't supposed to be doing. Let's just put it that way. Ah, it's picking up speed. Another thing, folks, on this, uh, when y'all doing this, let's see, I don't know. Maybe I can set right there. Um, set my cruise. And then I'm going to come down speed on my cruise. You can see right there we're doing 7 mile an hour. I'm going to set my cruise for 10. And uh, still doing good. So there you just pick that line right there. A little sil silver piece on the hood there. Just keep it on the, between those two rows right there. And you'll stay straight through the field. But at the end right here, I'm gonna come out so y'all can see. It's L B and B to stop them from no it's X. Yeah, X. See how my speed jumped up to ten? And it's not going crazy. And then just hit L B and X. Start spraying again. I'm going to kind of scoot over here a little bit. And you just put that little mark right there between those two rows. And you'll never go wrong. My dad always taught me, back when I was younger, worked on the farm. Uh, Mr. Heath was boss man. Had actually three of them. But uh, my dad always taught me to not look right at the end of the field but pick something out all the way down further yay Ooh, folks we got a big big uh, couple some money right there we need to do that more often but anyway uh, like say he was fixing the plant here he would step off from the end of the planter to the center of the planter, say it was a six row. So he'd count one, two, three. Okay? So that would be your half of your planter length right there. And he would take a jug and set it here. So he'd have something to go. He'd set the jug here, a big white two and a half gallon jug or something like that. And he'd drive down to the far end turn around get coming this way and he would he would scoot his planter over to that third row down there and as he was driving back from that end to this end planting he would have his ridge marker down let's see here one two three he'd be going through here but instead of looking at the jug there he told me I always look for something way off and drive to it when you get closer to this end. You know, when you start from the end down here, you drive to the jug, but when you get so far to the jug, you find you something way out there and drive to it. And that way, you'll come out even on the ends. But now, <laughs> now you don't have to do that. They are all this GPS and satellite service stuff now that you just hit two buttons, I think, one or two buttons, and you don't have to do nothing else. Oh so yeah, I think you have to set your head, uh, is that headline. Uh, I can't remember what it's called, but you gotta set your A and B. Ooh, I don't. I ain't gonna take that trailer up in there. Before I get hung up, and I'll hook it to the front of the tractor. I don't know 
why they do that. I'm going to see if I can back out of here. Hey, I got a little marker for the where well, I can hook up the trailer. A lot of times they have a thing. That's for the window. A lot of times they have a thing outside the window there you can reach. And it raises up the pull pin so you can just back up and hook straight up and it drops the pull pin back in without even getting in the tractor. Alright, uh, we got the fertilized buggy. Uh, I don't have to go to the bank, I don't think, to, to actually see my stats. Yeah, see right here, uh, we want to see how much we can, what is it, 100,000? Or 113,000. All right, folks. Uh, let's see here. We got about ten minutes left. Nine, ten minutes. We got our fertilizer rig. Uh, we need a plow. Okay, cheapest plow. Is there another one? Let's see, that is two meters, two meters, three meters. And that requires a 180 horsepower tractor. That looks like it would be bigger. Okay, three meters. Let's see what this one is. Uh, 1.9 meter. Wow. Two meter. Let's just go with this one right here and give us a hundred hundred thousand to work with. Let's go ahead and buy that bad boy. Because this time around, I want to make sure we do everything on the screen together like a family. All right. Oh, let's see here. What was that horsepower again? Uh, 85 horsepower. Oh, we should find one easily for that. Let's see. We got 100. Oh, let's see, 105. He's 99 horsepower. He is cheaper, folks. Uh, let's see here. That ain't one we got. We got that and, and that and. He's 127. Uh, that one's 117. See what we can do. We want a front loader. Max engine, what gives us 117 horsepower. Wide tires, nire tires, standard. Wide tires, 93,000. Okay. Oh, sorry, folks, it's taking so long. Uh, I kind of want to go with him, but we ain't got the money right now. See what we can do. Uh, that okay, one size engine, which brings it to 138. We're gonna leave the color. I don't know what the difference in the colors. They look the same to me. And that one, two thousand dollars. Oh no no no! We go back to free. Standard, narrow, and standard. Well, I guess standard tires be right. That's 125,800. <sighs> 125,800. Folks, we need one more mission. Uh,
Let's see here. Turn my beacons back on. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit so y'all can see. Oh, but yeah, but that's like it's black. got a big glare off the hood right there. We need. What did I say? I need 123,800. You get that fence. That would handle all our tractor needs pretty much. Because we have one for plowing, one for planting. Ooh. I forgot about that planter. Okay. We don't need this buggy no more, I don't think. I'm going to park it right here. I'm not going to fertilize right now because we need to uh, to wait, save our money. Well, in other words, what I'm talking about, we need to do a mission real quick. Buy us another tractor. Which we don't really need it right at this moment, but I know as soon as we start fertilizing and planting, our money's going to drop really, really low. Uh, we might just go a little bit over our, which uh, I don't think y'all mind, since it's the first episode on this map. We really, 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 really need a big chunk change. 12,000. Okay, 12,600. Oh, 14,000. 11, 12. Oh, we'll get back to that one combine. It's 14 with that. And, all right, this is the combine that I've been wanting on the other map. So let's check it out, folks. I got scared there for a second. It looks like a uh, roster moss reskin. I think I said that right. Ah, the trees. I'll hook up here. Get started. Oh, I love it. I love it, I love it, love it. Okay, I can't hire a worker. I'm going to have to do it myself. But uh, let's check this out real quick, and then I'm going to do a like a fast forward. 94.90 Flint. Wow, folks. I love it. Looky there. They should make it where the door, all the doors open up. We can service it and stuff. Let's see. Uh, turn the beacon lights on. Okay, got all the same lights and stuff. Wow, yeah. I like it, folks. We're going to have to get one of these as soon as possible. 35 foot head or two at that. I think that's what it was. Let's check out the inside. Oh, my goodness, folks. Look at there. They don't have a... Well, nowadays, this monitor here is usually with the camera monitors and stuff. Well, it does have a monitor right up there. Uh, buddy seat. Mm, make sure I ain't missing none. Yeah, folks, look at those controls. Oh, I could sit in this thing all day long. Oh. All right, let's see. Also, another thing, folks. Uh, oh, let's see. A to honk. I wish we had a grain buggy over here. We hit A, uh, the grain cart would come over to us. And yeah, folks, I, I want to go ahead and do this field anyway. That way we can get the price lower down. Because this probably be our next field we buy anyway. It'll last a good long. Oh, look, folks. It's the belt fed. Ain't it? Yeah, it's the belt fed. Yay. 
All right, I'm on a uh, forgot what button it is, but I'm fixing to silence the sound, and we're going to uh, fast forward this. Uh, yeah, folks. Uh oh, I didn't. There we go. Got to get my header right. Want to do it across the ends here. And then, uh, anyway, we're going to fast forward this, and uh, I'll catch you here in this second at the end of it, and then we'll say goodbye, okay? Uh, I'm going to go a little bit over an hour, but it'll be all right. Y'all enjoy it. Be right back. Alright folks, it should be any second now. What do y'all think about that? If you like me doing these missions and fast forwarding them and stuff like that, leave it down in the comments. But uh, y'all know what time it is. We're not going to be able to get our tractor this time around, but we'll come back, we'll do a couple missions, fertilizers, all that good stuff, but until then folks, all right, fourteen thousand and four, four thousand four hundred on top of that. So, whoa, it's eighteen, almost nineteen 
19. We're up to 118,000 now, folks. All right. Uh, what kind of... Oh, I want some manure. We'll come back uh, next time, folks, and, and uh, do this mission here. But uh, till later, folks. Hit that like button. Subscribe. Share it with your friends. And please, folks, y'all have a blessed day or night, wherever y'all are at. This is Mr. Blue on Shanofka. Hope I'm saying that right. Anyway, Mr. Blue, signing off.